Hey guys, <clears throat> this is a reading to see who's coming towards you and what do they want. Okay, we're going to pull four cards to get started. This reading is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Who's coming towards Taurus? Please show me with four cards. Who's coming towards Taurus? Hmm. Aries energy there. Somebody that's really not... They're choosing to be still, basically. Who's coming towards Taurus? Again, Aries, Leo energy. Sagittarius energy. Somebody's very confident. I feel like the reason why they're not coming towards you is because they feel like, you know, they've put in a lot of work. They've put in enough work and they did everything they could do with you guys. So I'm, I'm getting that if anything, they're expecting you to come towards them, whoever this is. Okay. One more card. Who's coming towards Taurus? Two of Swords. Again. Now, this is a thing. I feel like you have two people here. And it's divided like this. This person is not making a decision. This person's not making a move. Okay. It's almost like whoever this is has blinders on. Okay, so let's let's see what else we get. Please show me more about the two of wands energy. Yeah, there's a lot that happened between you guys. This person stuck on past events. They're just trying to find some tranquility right now, some solace in their life. Yeah, they're just ready to put something to bed. But I tell you this, they cannot be ready to put it to bed because they're still in your energy field, whoever this is. This person feels foolish when it comes to you guys. They feel like they made a mistake. They feel like they put in too much work. They did too much. Almost like they overextended themselves here. Okay. Please show me more about this Two of Swords energy. Put one over here. Yeah, this person, they're confused about their feelings for you. That is what that is. They have regrets about something that they've done. They're still hurt. They've moved on, but it's like they've moved on painstakingly and they really want to come back and address something with you guys but they have not decided to do that just yet okay so over here we have I feel Aries very strongly either Aries or Sagittarius energy is here and they may have like Gemini in their chart over here we have um, Cancer Libra, Scorpio, and Aquarius energy on this side. So let's see over here with this fire energy. <clears throat> let's see. What do they really want with Taurus? Okay. A lot of cards there. So let's see. What's, they want to make things right. They want the scales to be balanced. This person's angry. Whoever this is, it, it's like they have... Um, they have a little get back in them, whoever this is. They have a little get back in them. This person, I feel, be, be leery of this individual because whoever this is, they kind of want to wreak havoc on your life. But they're struggling, I feel, because when it's like this. When somebody gets hurt, you know, instantly you want to, like, act out. And you want like to, you know, have some get back, some revenge almost in you. But, and they feel like they're do that shit. So they feel like you really wrong them, whoever this is. 
you shook up their home, you shook up their life. They worked really hard to get their confidence back, to put themselves back together is what they feel. So now it's like they feel like you guys deserve to feel some repercussions from whatever it is that happened between the two of you. They they almost have like a little get back and they struggle. They got a little metaphorically. <laughs> they have a little angel on one shoulder and they have a little devil on the other shoulder. Is a thing. So be careful with this energy over here. They struggle with doing the right thing, actually, and just letting bygones be bygones, okay? What is this person over here, this this air and water energy? What do they want with Taurus? What do they really want with Taurus? Huh. This person's wanting to fight for you. This person is really, they see success with you guys. And I feel that they really, it's like they're taking a pause though. You guys may have blocked them. They may have blocked you once upon a time. But I see this person willing to to, to fight for what they want. To fight for um, their point of view. I don't see them making a decision though. Because they're really, it's like this person's very moody. One day they may feel like, okay, I'm going to contact Charles and I'm going to explain to them, you know, really how I feel. And then the next day it's like, no, 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 no. I've moved on from that. I don't want to reopen, rehash things. But this person's wanting to fight for you. Leo energy there. That's on a good day. So that's between September 5th through the 12th. But, I mean, yeah, I do see action here. I do see this person um, eventually reaching out to you. But they have to be able to, like, muddle through, you know, this unclear energy and figure out what the hell they really want. Okay, guys? So that is what I have for you, and I'll be speaking with you guys soon. Bye now.